Hello! Welcome to Quickfire English and this episode of You're Doing It Wrong, the show in which we tell you the common mistakes that learners of English make and show you how to correct them. Today's episode, commas, with numbers. So, let me ask you a question. Say we have the words 100,000. How should we write to that using numerals rather than words? Now, a lot of English learners will write this because it's how they would write 100,000 in their own languages. But this is incorrect. In English, a dot with numbers is a decimal point, which means the number we see here is not 100,000, it's actually 100.000. The correct way to separate the digits for 100,000 in English would actually be with a comma. With numbers of 1,000 and above, you can insert a comma after every three digits from the end of the number, just as we've done here. The main exception, however, is with years. For example, as I'm recording this video, it's 2019, and we don't put a comma after the two for that. Okay, let's talk decimal separators, and let me ask you another question. How should you write 9.81 in English? If your answer looked like this, then you're absolutely correct, because as we've already seen, in English we use a decimal point. Now, sometimes students get upset when I tell them this, and they insist that it should be 9,81, because that's what they write in their own languages. But I'm afraid that's just not how we do things in English, and 9,81 doesn't really mean anything for us. So, to sum up, with numbers of 1000 and above, you can insert a comma after every three digits from the end of the number. And if you need to write decimals, use a decimal point as your separator. Now, if you got something out of this video, do me a solid by hitting the like button, and please also consider subscribing. And if you think anyone else might benefit from the lesson, go ahead and share it with them. Finally, if you have a problem with English and you'd like a video lesson to help you, let me know what that problem is, either in the comments below or by email. Okay, we are out. Cheers for watching and I'll see you in the next video.